Today is the day we install the new faucet. We install or Dave installs? Dave installs and I observe. Okay. I'm going to help. Let's take a look at the faucet. This faucet. is our current situation. It's tough to get things. Low clearance. Yeah. Only one steady stream, no spray option, no nozzle. Yeah. I need an upgrade. All right, so we did get an upgrade. Uh, hopefully, we are going to install this Moen faucet that uh, has a uh, detachable spray nozzle. And it's going to be a little bit higher and probably look a little bit better than that chrome thingy. Mm -hmm. So here's what I had to get uh, to install this. Um, I got the whale fittings and uh, since the boat is metric, uh, this is metric on this end, but it's gone to a standard and then we can put this standard fitting on here and it'll match up with the 3 8 fitting on the sink. Easy peasy. This is Patricia and I'm Dave. During the summer of 2020, we traveled to French Polynesia for a sailing vacation. We had such a great time that we decided to buy a sailboat when we returned. Our new Jeannot Sun Odyssey 440 arrived in April of 2021. Watch as we outfit and upgrade Cavu, learn to sail first on the Texas coast, but eventually the world. All right, so this is what it looks like underneath the sink. And you can see the hot and the cold coming off of there. And so all I need to do is just change out those fittings to from probably a metric to a standard and we'll get us a new faucet in here. All right, so this first one came out pretty easy. And actually, I took it all the way out. So with these fittings, what you do is you press in, get the gray in, and then it's supposed to release. Might be a two-hand job. First one came out pretty easy. And, and a little twisty. Come on, release. final step in the uninstall is to remove the nut that's holding the faucet on and be sure to drop it into the bilge when you remove it. All the way down in. All right, that's out. I think I need this. You got the other faucet out. So let's 
see if we can feed these down here. Make this work. Put on there just like so. Is that the mowing came with its own installation tool, and that's going to fit over the, the uh, tube that's coming down and allow me to tighten up that nut. on the gasket it's kind of squared up there yeah that's gonna look good So next thing we got to do is this is our spray nozzle. Now it's really nice. It's got a really nice uh, swiveled end on it. And we're just going to feed this down through. There's my. All right. Clicked into place, a little downward tug. It's good. So I went ahead and put the adapters on uh, these, uh, I'm gonna call them whales. And then this will just fit together like that. Push it in and it clips on. Should be super easy. Locked in. Awesome sauce. Uh, the rest of the installation connection was pretty straightforward. Uh, the only difference was the water hoses were a little longer than what I needed. So I ended up routing them around. I had to play with them a little bit, but ended up routing them around the drains of the sink to hold them out of the way so they uh, wouldn't interfere with the uh, garbage can that also fits in that area. The other thing was the spray hose. It had to be uh, creatively routed as well to give freedom of movement. I must turn the water on. Moment of truth. Yeah. Mm. All right. Moment of truth. Will the new sink work? All right, you ready, babe? I'm gonna do it. Oh gosh, scary. <gasps> Any leaks? Yeah, All right, I'm gonna try the spray nozzle. All right. Good. All right, so here's the new faucet. It's all in place. It's got a nice you like it. Yeah, it's really nice. I approve.